Hey guys, how's it going? This is Rich Mincio with Allnet. Today I want to work on Mr. Carmelo Anthony shot. All right, so let's get into this. We're gonna bring it up, and we're gonna take a pause here, and we're going to zoom in. Again, watch the wrist, and watch what the, 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 the hand, the fingers have to do to maintain accuracy, to maintain the center, uh, actually the, the, the majority of the weight has to come back towards the middle line, the, the middle finger. Okay, so forward motion. Okay, you see his hand is on the outside of the ball. So the majority of the weight is sitting on the index finger. Well, he has to make that adjustment. If he was to take that wrist and to finish it straight, then that ball is going off to the left of the rim. So, what the great shooters do makes adjustment right here. Uh, it's really hard, hard to see, but there's more of a flex in the tip of that finger because you can see these fingers are already the ring finger is starting to come off. So, now he has to really apply. More pressure, bring fingers off, and then he pushes at the very end, pushes the index towards the middle, which now gets him to have a much better release. And you can see the backspin on the ball is good. Another shot. Okay. Again, now on this one, you can see hand placement is better. So now his ring finger is staying on the ball longer. So now he doesn't need to make uh, an adjustment or very little bit of an adjustment. So now look at those fingers. Still the index, still the middle, still the ring. Forward motion. Look at that. Didn't need to make any adjustment or, or very little. Uh, only he will know if it's very little. And then the wrist does a complete straight down and that was a complete middle finger release nice rotation on the ball let's go to another one okay again get different angle on this one okay now you can see that the wrist is a, is, is a little bent all right so that means if you can see the weight of the ball is being distributed differently on the fingers. So now watch what he has to compensate. Okay. Now do you see how the ring finger is slightly coming off? Index has to make a little bit of a push. Okay. And he's going to push it towards midline. Back towards middle finger. Just a little bit of pressure. And look, now we have a, a, a decent release. Wasn't a great release. Because if it was, then the ring finger will be sitting back here closer and being a nice straight line. But he still makes the adjustment and gets the ball to come off of the side of the middle finger. Right there. Again, makes it a good, nice backspin. Alright, so now, you guys, I'm trying to really, uh, you know, hammer home. There's, there's really... There's really no such thing as an index or an index middle finger or a ring finger middle finger shooter. Everybody is really a middle finger shooter, but how consistent are they is the key. And so everything is trying to always push back towards midline, midline being the middle finger. Uh, that's, the, that's the finger that's, that's getting the last touch on the ball and... Uh, the one that you want to get the last touch of the ball uh, can't always do that. It's a, very difficult to, to do on a, on a regular basis. That's why Steph Curry is so good because he does it on a regular basis. He gets the ball to leave the middle finger. Not only the middle finger, but the center of the middle finger. That's why he's the best shooter. So we'll go into, uh, we'll go into uh, another video here shortly. All right. Thank you guys for joining